got something I want to let you all know. So um, after the game on Saturday, that's going to be my last game. I'm going to retire from rugby full stop. Um, there's going to be a press release tomorrow, but I wanted to let you guys all know this evening so you don't find out by the press tomorrow. So, I've chosen to retire now because everything has to come to an end and I just couldn't think of a better way to end my career back home at the place I started rugby to be able to come here and finish it in front of friends and family just felt like the perfect ending and not many people get to choose the way they, they finish and have it on their terms and I, I feel very lucky that everything is aligned to allow me to, to do it this way. Yeah. Well, who's this in your bag? Uh, uh, I've got my little teddy. You got your teddy? What's your teddy's name? JB. JB. And then I've got a little turtle. Turtle. Little turtle. Who's turtle? Turtle. 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 All right. You know what, is that a new pair of World Cup? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Treating yourself. <laughs> Treating you? yourself. Do you know a fun fact? Go on and hit me up. Is it actually fun though? <laughs> <laughs> Probably not fun. I got my first cap in a pair of World Cups. Yeah. And I've got every other single cap ever since, either in my World Cups or my Copper Mundials. Fair play, fair and they're, play. They're brand that's, new. I'm not gonna lie, that's a lot of caps. Brand new. So all the young girls, all the young future Red Roses out there, this is what Sarah Hunter wore her whole playing career. This week has been really special. I guess you never know what the last week of your career is, is going to be like until, until you get there and since the news breaking that you know this is going to be my last game on Saturday uh, the amount of messages have just been overwhelming the, the love, the support that has been way beyond anything I could, could ever imagine the girls have been absolutely brilliant you know when, when they found out their reaction I think they were a bit shocked at first but but then I think when they understood the why behind it, they totally got behind me and supported me. The staff have been brilliant. Um, my phone has literally gone like on fire, like every day, it just hasn't stopped. Um, I've tried to get back to people. I will get back to people. Um, it's, been, it's been really touching. It's been really moving. There's been some emotional times. Mid set me off in the press conference. Um, there's been times where you look at a message and it just gets to you. There's been a lot of laughs along the way. Marley Packer asking me if I'm Monday on the way to train and that it was not too late to, to change my mind. To just like going, this is the last gym session. This is the last captain's run. Um, yeah, it, it, it's been it's been great. Apart from the moment I messed up the roses on red, that was not a particular high. But it gave everyone a laugh, so um, we'll roll with it. Rose on red. Rose Boys, we've got some scrum fix ups on the machine at the top. Oh no, you got to come I didn't have it on camera there, son. One, two, three, squeeze! Sarah, how does it feel to be back in Newcastle? Toot, toot, like a Harvey. <laughs> Honestly, the, the north air is just like no other. How are you feeling this morning, Sarah Hunter? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, look at her little teddies that sleep next to her bed. <laughs> 37 years old. Hey, Sarah Hunter. Hi, Martin Packer. So what are you doing now in your little book of notes? I am doing the first cap notes for their little red rose presentation this evening. Okay, and what is this presentation about? So, obviously we do normal shirt presentation, but if we have first caps, um, the captain stands up and says a few words about them and their rugby journey and presents them with a red rose and welcomes them into the red roses. Oh. So just so you know, when I take over as captain, you will get one line, congratulations to the red roses. Da 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 da! Um, so what are you two here to do this evening? We are here to, uh, Sarah Hunter before every big occasion cat normally stands up and says something about somebody um, so obviously with it being her big one we've decided to come and do a little bit for her. How do you feel? 
No, I feel good. I'm looking forward to it. It should be special. Special. You're special. not going to choke up? I don't think cry? the burner was just saying I'm not going to cry. I was like, I don't think I've got like a teary like feeling about me. That's good. That's good. I've got a happy feeling. Well, we'll see how tonight goes. Santa, you've just delivered another four new cap speeches and it's our absolute pleasure to be here to talk about your journey. So everybody, please settle in. Um, yeah. There's quite a few years to get through um, and most of you will kind of be too young for this reference. But Sarah Hunter, this is your life. <laughs> You're an infectious human and the place will not be the same without you. We're sure you're itching at the bits to get out there tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> and we cannot be prouder uh, uh, to be some of your closest friends and have shared a small part of this momentu monumental I know, like, You did that every time. Every time I read this. Monumental journey. It's been an absolute it's been absolutely fantastic. It really has been fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> Everything about you is just fantastic. <laughs> On behalf of Women's Rugby, the community, anyone you've ever played with and against, you truly have touched so many hearts and we want to say a massive thank you for all that you've done. Me being me, I've done a little research um, and white roses symbolise purity, loyalty and new beginnings and a whole lot of love. So with that, we'd like to present you with your own white rose. Go be the best version of yourself in front of a nation you've captivated, teammates and a staff group that admire and adore you. <sighs> I knew it was going to be this and your most loved friends and family. Number 137, we bloody love you. 141 and out at Kingston Park. Pressure. There you go. One for one. Over and out. And look, and uh, do you know? Is it the first time you've ever had your name on the back of your shirt? Yeah. Final cap, and the first time she's got a name on her shirt. How cool is that? I just want to try and enjoy the day. You know, I'm never going to get another chance to run out in a white shirt or to play rugby. So I want to make sure that I kind of soak up all of that, uh, whilst also balancing with that that it is an international game and I have to be really focused on like my performance, how I perform for the team, how the team's performing, so that's always been what I've been about, it's got to be about the team and how we best prep and like get through that and yeah hopefully once we've got that done can, can look back and just, just take it all in. Simple things done really well, okay? That's all we're about today. Go do your job and we'll be great. Yeah? Rose on red. Red roses! Aitchison. Three back inside to McDonald's! Kane! Then we'll come away with the ball again. To Eden. Breach. McDonald. Does she fancy this? A nice step back. Oh, that's lovely by Claudia McDonald. Can she finish? She's been hunted down, but it doesn't matter. Six metres left to travel. England hunting down a fourth try at Kingston Park. Here comes Tatiana Hurd! England 31, Scotland 0. I, I reckon the challenge for us is maintaining what we've done. When finishes start coming on, making sure we work really hard to keep the continuity going. But really, to, I mean, the chances we've created, the chances we've taken, have been absolutely superb. We've not done anything but do exactly what we've trained to do. 
just keep doing what we're doing. So the continuity of it, when people come on, and we see if we can get we can get an 80 minute performance in. Yeah, it's a big ask. It's a big ask, is that? Because we know things drop off. All right, but let's see if we can do that. Yeah, good effort, girls. Make sure we finish the job. Yeah. Good teams go to great by backing up first half performances. Yeah, the consistency we showed in that half, that ambition to play, that intent to play, is great. All right, but we have to come out and we have to back that up. Yeah, our patience has been phenomenal. Our intent to play has been phenomenal. Our intent to back up defence, all right, time and time again to not let them cross, brilliant. All right, this half, how good we can be to go into next week's game. We're relentless in our ambition to play. We're relentless in our defence. Rose on red. Red roses. Huge run by Totty Cleal. Oh, hello, Totty Cleal. Heard nice pass away to Dow. Still Abby Dow. Pass then in the end. Look at the strength from Sadia Kabea. Sarah Hunter's rugby career is over. Kingston Park rises. English rugby rises. The whole rugby family rises to recognise one of the greats. 16 years, 141 caps. Sarah Hunter, thank you. Well, it's an England victory. They are back to winning ways. But it was all about one woman in the end. It was a day for Sarah Hunter, but it's now Marley Packers England for the rest of this Six Nations. How special, how special has this been today? Oh, incredible. Like, Santi. I couldn't have asked for a better ending, genuinely. Like, this week has been incredible. Like, the love, the support, the messages, it's just been beyond my wildest imaginations. And the best thing about Sarah, she always has got time for everybody and she's always got a smile on her face. She is one of the great icons of all time of English rugby. And I think we should all just stand and just appreciate what a great woman she is. Yeah.